Hello everyone, and this is about our fifth, maybe sixth attempt at finding a video game today. Yeah. Either they didn't want to work, or they just didn't work at all. Like you'd get part of the way into it and then it would stop, or it just wouldn't. Yeah, it was horrific. I felt really bad. I felt really sad. So now it's sword and spoon though. Yeah, it's well, sword spoon, actually. It's not sword and spoon. I was joking. It's just sword spoon. <laughs> it's just sword spoon. The really slow killer with a very inefficient weapon. Oh, God. Legends tell of a secret castle. A castle stocked with food and guarded by a powerful army. The castle is hidden deep within the infinite forest. There's only one path to the castle. The king forbade his people from leaving the castle, and so the secret path lay hidden for many ages. It wasn't those wanting to leave by the path that worried him. Rather, it was those who wanted to get in. Wow, that went by way too fast, actually. Okay. Eh. Oh, God. Build a barrack. Wait for construction. The soldiers will automatically rush to defend the castle. That's not a joke. Go. Fight, my minions. Is this tower defense? Uh, it's kind of tower defense. I have played a little bit of it before. Okay. Press the caps lock key for instant movement. No. Um, that's a bit of a problem. <laughs> well, it's just, you press the button, and it doesn't mute the whole thing for the for Bandicam. Yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of different ways to record. In case one way doesn't work. I even have fraps. I love seeing the frame rates and everything I play and uh, being really sad that for some reason Stardew Valley goes down to 10 frames per second when I enter the menu. I don't know why. It just does. It just does. <laughs> uh, your troops need food. Yeah. I thought this castle was supposed to be well stocked. It's not. But it is. Twas but a lie, and now things want to go after us for things we don't have. That's not going to be a problem in the future, I hope. Okay, then. I mean, that, that wasn't, that wasn't, uh... Yeah, you run. You run. This game is really weirdly framey, but that's just the natural state of the game. Enemies come from the right. Don't let them destroy the gate. Oh, no. Bird! It's like, I'm getting Duck out of here. Is this Duck Hunt? Seriously, though. Naming a place the Infinite Forest is quite a name. Yeah, we have to wait for enemies to come to us. It is such a slow thing. Reposition the melee units. Put them right there. So that way they fight everything constantly. Death to all. Look, he gave me five coins. Oh my god, I'm never going to make enough money to survive. Why does it cost me money to defend my own castle? Realism. Yeah. You go, servant guy who stands there looking like a dimwit. He needs food. Uh, sorry, I gotta go get a potato. They literally just eat raw potato, though. Look at that. Munch. Ha <laughs> Delicious. What is wrong with these people? Stab. Are those orcs or goblins? Or are they goblin orcs? They said orcs. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Goblin orcs. Ah. Are you trying to draw someone in there? What? By calling them goblins? Oh, Jesus. As, as a fun story for you guys, uh, for my next playthrough, I've been reading up about a lot on the lore of a certain game series, and I really have to, oh, summon additional soldiers to fight along, fight with the Zeppelin army. They're called the Zeppelin army? <laughs> Is that because they crash and burn? <laughs> I hope not. It's too bad you didn't get to uh, name whoever you are, King whatever. King Incontinentia. You could have called him Hindenburg. Oh, God. Uh, what was I going to say? No, that's right. Oh, look. You get rewards for doing things. 
<laughs> you better. You better. Unit, I know how to upgrade things. Increase all servants' movement speed. Increase the melee soldiers' HP by 5. You're going to need that. Increase range soldiers' movement speed by 50%. Why? Decrease the cooldown of all support abilities. I need that. Damage taken by melee soldiers reduced by 20%. Yes, please. What was that noise? Ah, use the potatoes. Use the potato skill to bombard the enemy with potatoes. <gasps> Archers, standard range units that are powerful in numbers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only in numbers. One archer, not worth anything. 30 archers, you are defended well. I already messed up. <laughs> forfeit? I'm too early in this match to forfeit. Ah. Really? Of course. You restarted. And thus the, the tutorials must also restart. Oh, that's right. They have voice acting. I forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> Perhaps that was not the best choice. Just kidding, I love bad voice acting. Ah, uh, go Archer, go Archer, go. <sighs> Taste, put. They're dead, never mind. Oh, I can't cancel this? I guess you gotta wait. <laughs> Or I trigger the next wave exactly where they spawn in. Heh 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 heh. Oh, oh, oh. It seems like there's too many of them. What am I ever in what I do? <laughs> oh my god, it's so slow paced though. How do I speed this up? You don't. I feel tension just because it's so slow. Those arrows move so slowly you could catch them. Safely. <laughs> Not even just as movie bullshit. You could just literally catch them. Did you know you could do that in uh, any Elder Scrolls game, really? You could just catch the arrows out of the sky before they hit you if you're quick enough. <laughs> and it's really funny if you do that because you got like an archer that's shooting it and you're like, d d d d thanks for the Daedric arrows. <laughs> and they're like, what? Uh... I imagine I am quite an insufferable person to fight against. <laughs> Not as insufferable as the people that just spam invisibility in Dark Souls, what was it, 2 or 3? Dark Souls 3, but also, what voice are you doing? And they're not spamming invisibility, that's just their natural state of being. No, no, remember that guy that was in Vader? Waiting for you to die to the other stuff? Yes, but, uh, people are going to be naturally invisible to you? depending on your distance from them. Yes, he had buffs to make him more invisible, but it's not really the overall thing that matters there. I meant the fact that when you were in the same room as the guy, you couldn't see him. Oh. Because he spammed a spell so that he would be invisible. That wasn't a spell, that was a ring. Ah. However, he kept spamming spells at me and for some reason did not run out of his Estus. How do they hack on PlayStation? That's the big question. And you can't leave the area until either they die or you die too, so you killed everything. I killed literally everything in that area, and I was like, I can't find this guy. And then he was just sitting up on a, like, a balcony point and killed me. Yeah. And this went on for over an hour. <laughs> I was angry. You almost killed him too, but you made one wrong swing. I swung too many times, and he, and he uh, killed me because of it. Because he used a quick spell. Cheesing his way through the game. I hate him. Upgrade the abilities of your soldiers to make them stronger. I do that. I do that a lot. Yeah. yeah. Is it wrong that it sounds like they're saying gay? Yeah. <laughs> I don't hear that. I hear... Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Too bad we can't make mashed potatoes after off of that potato attack. That would be delicious. I love mashed potatoes. Just gonna drop these guys in there so they dwindle their numbers a little bit. 
Oh my god, it's so slow. Why would you make this game this slow paced? Is there. Oh, it's doing it again! My throat! <laughs> There no, is there no option to speed up the game? Help me, I'm dying. No. <laughs> Increase the malicious power. Yes, destroy them all. Can you only have one servant? Yes. Well, for now, until we unlock the second floor. Why can't we not unlock the second floor on our own castle? Ignore my yelling. I'm just moderately frustrated. Info. Orc captain. Oh. Neat. Yeah, there's actual reasons in this game as to why you can't invest all in one skill tree, which is actually why I failed my first time playing this game. Because you're like, ah, oh, I'm going to cheese it with arrows. Yeah, because like, they, if they can't reach me, they can't do anything to me. But no, there are enemies that genuinely you cannot hit. If you go either all melee or all arrows. That is just, honestly, that messes with me. Yeah, but uh, arrows are a great way to go either way. And rain in potatoes. Potato quality, sorry guys. Uh, I mean, technically it is. I'm recording this in a really weird format. Oh, they killed them all. I'm actually surprised. Better dodge chance. Better split arrow. And send in the next wave. Even more birds flee. Well, they have a right to with this many orcs that are just slow moving. Then again, they don't need to run away that fast. They have plenty of time to get away. Did you see the slow motion flap of the birds? Did, did they really? Kinda. That is stunning. Also, did you notice that the clouds are strange? That one's shaped like a sword. That one's also shaped like a sword. That one's not shaped like a sword. That one's not shaped like a sword. Wait, I already said that one was shaped like a sword. Uh. I like how, by the way, I had to look at you. And you, then you, uh, then you contemplated what I had said. <laughs> it took me a while to completely load a response because it was so dumbfoundingly stupid that my brain went into overdrive trying to analyze it. It's like with Teletubbies, okay? Remember oh, that's I, I right. told you? It's, as a kid, I was, I was completely and, and utterly trying to figure out the secret of Teletubbies because I figured it could not be that simple and it could not be that stupid and be on TV. <laughs> This this is this is a like a five six seven year old up to there still trying to figure out the secret of Teletubbies this whole time trying to figure it out why is this on TV what does it mean <laughs> baby face son <laughs> <laughs> I think I think that's great that is just honestly a fantastic thing to do I made a terrible choice I made I can't take it back reset. Oh, I can reset everything free of charge. It's a miracle. Oh, wait. Oh. Time to space it out. Space it out. Why would I want that? Not right now, anyways. Uh, I guess let's just go. Let's just go. To the great beyond. Defeated enemies may drop scrolls. Collect them to unlock new skills. Why would I want new skills? I'm already good enough, right? I'm joking. I'm terrible. Ha ha! Knights wear heavy armor, making them more durable in combat. Okay. You still get those from the barrack, though. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. 
Smithers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Smithers. Oh yeah, you are officially Mr. Burns. This is your castle. Release the hounds. <laughs> I live off of their hatred. Thankfully, everyone hates me because I chose to live here. And I only feed them raw potatoes. <laughs> that is a very Mr. Birds thing to do, isn't it? Yes. It saves money. I can just feed them potatoes. Raw, raw potatoes. Just keeps dropping in more enemies. I mean, enemies. Ah, uh, soldiers. No, my soldiers are not my enemy, I swear. They're somebody's enemy. 